When having radiotherapy to your head and neck, you can experience many different side effects. One of these might be a sore mouth. Mouth soreness and throat soreness with head and neck radiotherapy is very common, unfortunately. If it, the soreness is on the outside on your skin, they might recommend particular creams that you can use to help with that. If the pain is internal, you may be referred to the doctor and the doctor will suggest some medication to help control the pain. Probably, I think it was from week two to week three when the radiotherapy uh, side effects started really impacting me. At that point, really, I was unable to eat. The ability to take food down your food tract with that level of uh, inflammation and ulcers uh, was just too difficult. So mouth soreness can continue for up to three months. The team will support you during that time, whether that be with some medication or some skincare advice. They'll also check your mouth quite regularly to make sure you don't have an infection, which might be slowing down the recovery time. They always checked the condition of my mouth and made sure that it was in good health, recovering, and if there was any issues, they just supported and advised me on, on the best way to deal with it. For information on other head and neck radiotherapy side effects, visit the Cancer Research UK website.